Hello, my name is Brandon Lindscheid. Uh, welcome to Transfer Orientation. Uh, I'm from Reedley College and my major here at UC Davis is Biochemistry and Molecular Biology. After I graduate from UC Davis, I plan to get my doctorate in Biochemistry. My, the most challenging thing for me coming into UCD was definitely the transition to the quarter system from the semester system. After my first quarter, I had kind of a downfall. Um, I didn't realize exactly how strenuous the load was here. I didn't realize exactly how quickly things went. It's difficult to see why people say that this transition is so hard, is because you're going to class the same exact amount that you would at community college here, except the pace is just so much faster. So everything seems the same until about week three or four when midterms roll around, and you think that you still have about two more weeks of review left on the material and the concepts that you've just been taught. That's not the case. You definitely can't take a day off. You need to study as much as you can every day, even if you don't feel like you want to. I've noticed that, yeah, you need to be kind of on your game all the time, that you need to you know, try to get those A's in your classes because your professors are gonna recognize these A's, they're gonna recognize your hard work, may even offer you a letter of rec or a position in their lab. If you don't do as hot, you're not gonna be called back. For the most part, I was told by my brother, who is a former alumni here, uh, pretty much everything I needed to know other than the little nitty-gritty things that I needed to find out for myself. One of those things, lock your bike up. Don't adopt pets. <laughs> Don't adopt pets. It's, um, it, God, it takes so much time. If you adopt a pet, uh, it requires your attention and you can't focus on your studies. You have to, it's like having a child. So that's a big thing. I know that you could be lonely coming here. I know that it can be very scary because you're in a new place and you have no friends. Like me, I, I had no one here when I first came. Well, if you're, if you're feeling that you're at all alone or that this experience that you're going through is very scary, uh, know that there's a lot of people who are in the same shoes that you are in right now. You're not alone. Plenty of people who you can talk to, like your basket advisors, um, they helped me a lot by allowing me to just get off my chest what I had been worrying about for the last month or two or a week even. I used to think that it was uh, okay to just form a study group wherever and try to study wherever, say at like my apartment or at a coffee shop, but that doesn't always necessarily mean that you're going to get work done and that you're going to learn what you're trying to learn. So I recommend you either go to the library or somewhere on campus that'll keep you focused on what you need to do. Don't take a day off. That's the biggest thing. Hour breaks are perfect if you can keep to an hour. Um, my problem coming in here was, well, I like to take a couple days off because in community college, it was no problem. You could take a week off if you wanted to and not show up to class. I mean, I never did that. I never didn't show, I always attended. But the thing about taking the day off, taking uh, a week off of not doing any homework or any assignments that are given to you or prescribed to you by your professors, uh, having that mentality here just doesn't work. Uh, you have to study every day. You must keep pushing even though you don't want to. I've also found that um, planning my classes in the morning allows me to wake up earlier and get my day started. Coffee. Coffee. <laughs> <laughs> Coho. Coho, definitely. There's, uh, there's so many different venues inside Coho. It's a coffee house, that's what Coho stands for, right? There's just a bunch of different venues inside of there. If you're feeling sushi, they've got it. Uh, if you're feeling like just a salad, they've got it. They've got a sandwich shop. They've got a uh, coffee shop, obviously, inside uh, called Swirls. It's good stuff.